Hi all, welcome to Santa Kilan. Thank you for watching our video. If you like this video, kindly click on the like button and share the video to your friends. Don't forget to subscribe our channel. Particular kind of a system that is nothing but known as the IoT, known as Internet of Things. Data transmission. From now the next is we have to get the certificates. So to get the certificates, we have many process to be followed, like create a thing, create a policy, and inside that policy we have to enable the policy, and after that finally we'll be able to download the four different certificates. So hereby, let us get back to our IoT. So now get to the thing, things, manage things inside the IoT code. So go for services. So here we have Internet of Things IoT core. Now, if you want to monitor any of the data, means here it is possible to monitor. The same thing to monitor the activity. It also can be done over here. Now go for things. Manage things. So previously I have shown you that uh, respective output through this thing only now i'm going to create another thing so create single thing next enter the name i am providing it as master create a shadow with the help of shadow we will be able to communicate with mqtt so here also i am using that mqtt protocol to communicate between raspberry pi as well as aws and i need some uh, name for shadow i am providing it as pan auto generate so here i have to generate that particular certificate so click on next before generating the certificate we require uh, this particular policy so click on create policy here it is the most important part so click on that give a name so the name is ras iot the name of the policy is ras iot action so like iot publish iot subscribe uh, if you are going to do only one portion means we can select this but I require my policy to be a multiple function so I am selecting as IOT star the same thing uh, since we don't have any other actions uh, this action will be enabled for all the purpose and therefore we have to change this resource here and also since we don't have any specified topic so we will be able to connect at any time and simple connection can be made click on allow now after that click on create policy is created get back to the policy attachment so click on RAS IOT create a thing now we will be receiving some certificates we have to download that so here we have the certificates click on download here it will be asking for the permission enable the permission it gets downloaded after that after that now download the private key that is most important public key is also not most important and the root to ca1 so let us wait till it get downloaded now once after the certificate gets completed we will be able to download or move to the next step the reason is once the certificate page gets closed you won't be able to open it again so make sure when you are doing for the first time within that particular time itself download everything all the files even if it is necessary so hereby we have downloaded the three this is known as device certificate private key and the ca certificate thank you for watching our video if you like this video kindly click on the like button and share the video to your friends don't forget to subscribe our channel